guys. What's up? School. My middle school was not that bad. Ghetto place, but nice teachers. All right, so my older schools were the weirdest crap ever. So I remember I used to have this teacher called Mr. Kiefer. Everybody used to sit in his class for about 87 minutes because we had black classes, just three classes the whole day, but they're long and annoying. So Mr. Kiefer, this is exactly what he did. He pulled out a book, read for 87 minutes. Everyone in his class slept on the deck. Like when he was done, he had to wake everybody up with his fucking alarm because everyone slept. That's like my favorite class because it was like the first of the day. I got the best sleep until like 10.30. And then came science class where the stupid bitch gave us like experiments. Like, okay, so it was bad enough that we had to draw charts. Then we had to draw charts of the charts. We had to use crayons and crap. I remember one coloring assignment. My God, she made us color a plateau. And you should have seen it since we're middle schoolers. That's exactly what happened. I ended up coloring the grass with red because I didn't have green. Like, can I color the grass red? She's like, sure. And then so there was a substitute, so you know? And then the teacher gave us an F because I colored the grass red. That was the only okay part because the teacher said, the substitute said that I could. But my other classmates, dumb fucks. One guy colored the clouds green, like what the fuck? If he had a green crayon, why didn't he just give it to me? I could have colored the grass. And the girl, she's blonde, um, she colored everything black. I'm like what the fuck? It's supposed to be a, a beautiful thing. Nothing beautiful ever comes in black. Wow, that's actually really racist. Except Beyonce, Rihanna, and everybody else. Social studies, which the teacher loved me. And I wasn't even a suck up. He just liked me because I was the best in the class. But you know, that decreased. And then I went to the school called Westport. Ghetto a school I've been to. People having sex everywhere. This one guy wore a c- oh, this one chick, she flung around a condom and like, stick the condom and she flung it while the teacher was like turning her back. People caught it and they were just like, I didn't do shit. And they just flung it again. And one time I had it and I was just like juggling it. This black kid was like, stop it. And then he slaps the condom out of my hand and hits the teacher. Nobody got in trouble because she couldn't figure out who it was. Sure, it was Mrs. Frick. But the kids at my school was like, hey, bitch, stop teaching help. Teach us about sex. And <laughs> it was so funny. She faced torture every day. Like, I felt bad for her, but funny at the same time. Like, her face was hit with the condom. How's that not funny? <laughs> So today we're gonna bring learn about penis. What? What was that? <laughs> I copied off him. Guess what? When the test results came, I got a 10 out of 50. He got a 7. Like what the heck? I cheated off of you, bro. My soccer coach. He swore. Okay, so at first day of practice, I kicked the ball so hard as I kick ball. It's like you son of a bitch. This is not kickball, you ass. Subscribe, like, and comment.